So before we proceed with the rest of this video, I will repeat what I have already said in the Assassin's Creed Origins video. Please understand that a quad-core CPU without hyper-threading cannot pull constant 60 frames per second in this game. If you do indeed own a quad-core CPU and the game is running at 30 to 40 frames per second, you are better off locking it to 30 and just enjoying the game without any additional hassle. This guide sadly won't help make Assassin's Creed Odyssey all of a sudden run at 60 frames per second if your system is CPU bottlenecked. A rough explanation of what CPU bottleneck actually is, is shown on the screen now. Long gone are the days of quad-core processors running AAA games at 60 frames per second. So please stop expecting it. Now, for those that own a CPU that isn't humiliated by Assassin's Creed Odyssey, any Intel 8 Gen Core i5 desktop CPU for example, welcome to a simple guide on how to improve the performance of uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. This is not a typical benchmark video that will show you what it's like to play the game on certain hardware, this is a video that will show you what it's like to improve the performance of the game on certain hardware. Before we proceed with the optimization process, uh, you will need to head over to my website and uh, download the installation package for the low specs experience. The download link is located in the description of this video. Low Specs Experience is a game optimization tool that I developed uh, that will allow you to optimize your favorite games for maximum performance. Now start the installation process for the Low Specs Experience. Once it's done, uh, start it from your desktop shortcut and uh, head over to the optimization catalog section. From this job down menu select Assassin's Creed Odyssey and then uh, press uh, load the optimization package. Now the low specs experience will automatically check if your game is supported by this optimization. If it is, press ok and the optimization control panel will load. When the optimization control panel loads, uh, simply select the method of optimization and resolution you would like to run your game on. This is something you will need to experiment on your own in order to see what works for the system the best. Once you decide which optimization method and resolution you are going to use, press the execute optimization button and then uh, start your game. Also, if you are not satisfied with what you see, simply choose the restore default option which will restore your game to default settings. That's all from me for now. If you like what I do, please be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more similar content. Anyway, I'll see you all next time.
There they are. I'll sneak up on them, my like this. Let's go. Huh? I heard them. That Marcos is going to be next. Time to get Phoebe out of here. Cassandra, I'm here! Untie me! 